amid all of our to-do lists, activities, and commitments. With our schedules, responsibilities, and people counting on us, in the middle of all of the demands for our attention and our time, wouldn't it be nice to just be? Hello, I'm Dr. Elizabeth Topp, and I study what it means to be present. To feel the sun on our skin, to notice our breath moving in and out of our bodies, and to appreciate who we're with in the moment we are together. Wouldn't it be nice, as we ourselves learn to be present, if we could teach our children how to be human beings instead of human doings? As we know children are born present, it is with socialization that we move them away from being fully in the moment. What Does It Mean to Be Present is a refreshing new children's book that explores the idea of being in the moment in a language that children can understand and parents can appreciate. Light-hearted, simple, and earnest, what does it mean to be present gives teachers, parents, and other grown-ups a chance to talk to children and teach them about the simple joys of not rushing, of being aware and alert wherever you are, and appreciating what you've got. To learn more about what does it mean to be present or to purchase a copy, please visit the Little Pickle Press website at www.littlepicklepress.com.